But what is going on everybody? It's your boy X coming at y'all with a brand new video and as you guys can see we picked up the BAM out of bio at the time of recording this. I picked him up for about 100k. Nice little snipe at the time of recording if anybody wants to like look back at what his price is going for and he's going to be super cheap. Um, I'm probably going to throw him back up after this because I feel he's definitely going to get cheaper. I have a video coming on about how you guys can make him tea tomorrow. Don't worry about that. But he is an amazing card. If you guys want to see the full stats, that link to the description will be down below. You guys can check that out. But we're going to hop into freestyle and I'm going to show you guys what he's looking like because it's absolutely insane. This Bam out of bio easily is a top five card in the game and easily a top three center. You could even argue the best center. Like this Bam out of bio is crazy. They gave him quick draw and range extender both on gold, which is just wild. He has a 93 point shot. Look at this. He comes at 97 with this. Look at all the A's. Look at all the A's. This is an opal basically in a diamond in card's body. Ooh, not a bad release. Not a bad release. It's actually, it's a little slow, but again, it kind of reminds me of like Reggie Lewis or like Mitch Richmond. It's not like, it's not great, but it's kind of, it's one of those shots that like is a little bit slower, which I think is going to make it a lot easier to green. It's not, you know, crazy, super OP jump shot, but as far as centers go, I don't think that's that bad. Obviously, he definitely would benefit from a Hall of Fame quick draw, um, but it's not bad. At the time of recording is actually as well. We have a, the dunk contest are going on. Look at that. Um, if you guys didn't know, he can speed boost. He has a 78 speed ball. I definitely would throw a speed with ball shoot on him. But the fact that Bam Adebayo, who is not a shooter, has gold range extender and can just cash from deep is crazy. Like, absolutely insane stuff. Look at that. He's just cashing from deep, man. It's crazy. He can driving dunk, standing dunk. He got awesome post moves. Uh, let's check out the post fade real quick. All right, not bad. Not great, but not bad. I'm not the biggest fan of it, but it's not bad. And obviously, he's got the, the same cheesy post. So I'm going to check his... Off dribble. Uh, okay, for a center, for a center, it's not actually not awful. I actually like it going to his left hand. Yeah, not bad. Uh, once you get rid of, I mean, used to timing, I think uh, this is gonna be a great card and a great release. Yeah, I'm excited. With we're gonna hop into a game. Um, not exactly sure who we're gonna be using. I think it might be better to use like Brandon Roy, um, a Bam Adebayo, and then Giannis, or maybe I should have Bam play the center. Because obviously he's a little bit quicker. I feel like that might be okay. Yeah, we'll use Brandon Roy, Antoine Walker, and then Bam Adebayo. I think that works great. And we have Dwight Howard, who just dressed up in the Superman stuff for his second dunk, uh, which I think is awesome. So here we go. Brandon Roy. Here is our Antoine Walker, pink diamond. And then we can snag the Bam Adebayo. Uh, what does kind of suck is the fact that he's a center. So only, I think, with perimeter centric do you get a three point boost. But he has a 90, so I really don't think it's too big of a deal. So, yeah. There is that. Oh, my stream just froze of the game, but whatever. We're going to hop into the game. Oh, it's back up. We're going to hop into the game and see what's going on there. Ooh, pretty nice dunk by Dwight. If you guys are watching right now, pretty nice dunk by Dwight. His second dunk. Uh, not too bad. And I'm also uh, happy to see that he's in there having some fun. So here we go. Getting nice and juicy. Hopefully we have not too crazy of a matchup, but I know we have a great team. You know, which might sway. I would love to see Bam Adebayo go up against a smaller guard just because he has Hall of Fame clamps, so he's going to be able to play good defense. And he's going to go up against Anthony Davis. I'm pretty sure he's going to go up against Davis, which is not bad, especially that Anthony Davis, because I feel like we have a big mismatch with Bam Adebayo. We're going to be faster. We're going to be able to handle the rock better, and we can shoot, play better defense. So I just, I think, I think Bam is going to have a huge um, advantage here. To give it to him. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, come on, dunk on him. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Two points for Bam out of bio. Also, love him in this Grizzlies attire. I think he looks sick. You know I mean? John Bam out of bio would be kind of cool. We just got up. Oh, I forgot you guys got half defensive leader. That's big. That's big. He also was not in the paint to grab that. And he gets a little green. Not too bad. I want to see what his ratings are. I know he has a 78 speed of ball. All right, not bad. He's got like A pluses and everything. Oh, she isn't bad. You think? Six foot ten centers out here doing momentum crosses and pulling up from deep. That is crazy. Oh, we jumped too much. I'll throw it to the corner. Damn, I was hoping. I was hopeful. I was hopeful. He's, oh, he's going to try to cook Bam. Yeah. All right, he got the blow by it somehow. But, oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, Bam's out here. Let's go. He's going to pull back on a stick. Ooh, flashy dunk. There we go. He's got seven. If you guys didn't see that right there, he's got Hall of Fame downhill, which is going to help him like crazy. Uh, you guys didn't know downhill helps when you're running down the floor on the fast break. It increases your speed. So if a card has Hall of Fame, especially a card that's a little bit slower with ball, like Bam at a bio, which is going to give him that 
extra boost just to be a little bit quicker and I think it's gonna be nice especially in transition you can really grab the ball with bam just like um, you do with a Giannis oh yeah oh we waited no it was an early oh we waited that was bad Ooh, AD's going oh, so, oh he's got Hall of Fame Dimer as well oh he can't do the behind the back but he does have like um, the curry little thing oh, we shouldn't have taken that oh he got it he got it let's go boop get a pump fake oh wait we had a shot clock violation oh man I wasn't paying attention I was trying to get a hook shot with bam the one thing that's a little tough is whenever people realize that you're just straight trying to score with one card is they definitely will do anything in their power to make sure that doesn't happen I'm trying to get blocks with bam it is not working they'll do anything in their power to try and stop you here we go bam out of bio oh yeah he stepped off that's might be a little <laughs> I thought that was going to be a little deep, but there we go. 10 points with Bam and Bio. I'm surprised we're hitting white. But again, I actually, I don't mind his release. Like I said, it's a little bit slower, but that actually makes it a little bit easier to time. I know we've had back-to-back -back bad whites. But it's not that he's following Bam the entire way. Oh, we could have shot that again. Woo, little hop, little hop, get around. And filet, there we go. Bam and Bio, 12 points, and he's playing great. I'm liking it. I like this card overall. I think it's actually really nice. I mean, I looked at the stats and I was like, oh, like, Bam's going to be crazy. And he he's crazy. Like, he's actually an insane card. And I can't believe that they gave us back-to-back, -back, like, Miles Bridges and this Bam out of bio. Back-to-back -back diamonds that are basically Opals stats-wise and badge-wise. They're just diamonds. <laughs> like, their intangibles have to be low. I haven't looked at them. Oh, um, another thing. Oh, yeah, he's giving us a wide open lane. Oh, but Ben Simmons had to step in and ruin it there. Let's go. And a, and a bio. Oh, what was that pass? Why would you even chuck that? That was bad. Antoine Walker gets the break there. And we get the easy steal with Bam at a bio. We're going to walk over here. Bang. Oh, he's contested. <laughs> oh, my Lord. He's hitting contested whites. 60% contested whites are just falling. Look at that. His intimidator is popping up as we get that easy, easy stop. Okay, so his Hezzy's a little bit slow, which I kind of expected. That's, oh, no, 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 we took a jumper. No, we took a jumper. That's tough. That's tough. Ben Simmons is going to the paint. Oh, I pressed triangle instead of square. That messed us up a little bit. That was definitely not a very smart oop. AD is not going to be back. So that's an easy little three. But we white it because we're trash. Here we go. Not playing defense. Let's call the pick, see how he plays it. All right, we can go around it. We have him wide open. We definitely could pass, but I don't want to. I just want to score with Bam. He's double teaming me now, which I'm not liking, but he's catching up. That's the one thing. I've always said I'm not the greatest with centers or power forwards, just big men in general. I'm not the greatest with them, but we're going we're gonna to try to make it work. We're going to try to finish it off. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's early. That's early. That's the one bad thing about having a slightly uh, slower release is that can happen, but boom. Easy drive to the paint and nice little two for Bam Adebayo. He's got 17 points, only one rebound. Only one rebound. That's because everybody else is taking him, which is tough. Can his 80 hit it? He's got a 50% chance. Oh, not if he whites like that. Oh, Brandon Roy gets it. We're running down the court out of bio. I thought he was going to have an open three. Let's get a little momentum. Ooh, snatch back and then go into the paint. Dunking on AD. He's got 19 points. And I'm really, really liking his Adebayo guard. I just... For some reason, I keep messing up his name when I try to say it quick. Couldn't tell you why, but I'm, I'm liking the guard. I'm liking the guard. As a like, stretch center, he's going to play it amazing defensively. He's going to be awesome, despite the fact that he's slightly undersized. I really don't mind it, but wait. Oh, yeah, he does not have a good behind the back. Wait, wide up for the dunk. Let's get it flashy, and there we go. Finishing off with Bam out of bio. Let's check the game stats real twi quick. 21 points, one rebound. He had a steal as well. Sadly, a turnover. But 9 of 15 from 3, 3 of 6 from... 9 of 15 from the field, 3 of 16 from 3. He gets a 94 sh shot with the uh, boost that we get from Floor General. And he is just amazing. Look at this. Offensively, just great plays. Good defense, too. All around beast of a center. Slower release, like I said, but you can still cash out. And it actually makes it easier to green uh, because it's slower. So, I like it. I like it. Uh, look, if you guys did enjoy, comment down below what you guys think of this Bam had a bio card. And subscribe if you guys are new on that road to 4.1K. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And I will see you all in the next video. So